Uh, my name is James Budia. I'm the project manager of Kibwezi Forest Reserve. This forest is special because it is a haven for elephants and at the same time it has a spring that uh, gives people on the outside water. So it's a lifeline for many people. Other than ant poaching work, we have secured uh, the forest. The fence has been of great use uh, in ensuring that animals will not spill over to the villages and it has been able to contain human wildlife conflict. Where well, we came in when this forest was almost gone and nobody was taking care of it, poachers would walk freely. They would come and kill elephants at wild levels that are in here. The people would come and cut down trees. We were able now to secure this particular forest and the elephants now are safe and secure. And that's why we also have an elephant program going on in this forest because it's safe for, for, for wildlife. We have realized that uh, we cannot conserve here without the communities. We literally donate seedlings to the members of the community. So it's, it's the success, the success of this, the milestones that we've made together. When I look back at how we've grown, how we've been able to save wildlife, how we've been able to save a habitat like Ibuese Forest. When you look at the, the turnaround, how things have changed, the regeneration of the forest, the fence lines that we are doing now, and how we have been able to secure Kibwezi Forest and the Greater Shul ecosystem. What the Trust is doing is an exemplary job. And when you look back from how, where we started and where we are, you just want to continue to cover more ground for wildlife and to protect the habitats.